What's going on guys? Joe with OMGRC here. So today, some of a few of these RC cars. Um, let's just go right to the armor right this second here. What am I gonna sell it for? It's gonna be like around, I'm gonna sell it for like 450. If you don't want the electronics in it, servo, the electronic speed controller, the receiver, and the motor itself, then go ahead and just knock another uh, 125 off of that 450 price right there. Now, um, it doesn't come with the radio just because the radio failed on me and I'm not gonna pass that same issue to someone else. So that, you, there's no negotiating on that one. You don't get a radio with it. Um, and I'll go over the conditions of it here soon. It, as far as the box goes, I'm not shipping the box that's extra weight and I can't ship it in a retail box and it would get stolen in a retail box. So, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> anyway, um, as far as when it comes to the Scout, so the Red Cat Gen 8, this is an orange one, it just only has minor box damage here or it has, some have like some holes where something punctured or whatever, but everything inside of it is perfectly fine. These are all fully 100% warrantied by Red Cat, since we're an authorized dealer for Red Cat and Kyosho. And as far as that one, so what we're gonna do with this one here, it's gonna be, uh, it goes for $299.99 and if you use a promo code, save you 25 bucks on these particular vehicles and this is the orange ones only so I have a few of those if by chance you're looking for just parts only you can always hit up our eBay store at OMG RC and we have some of these already like as far as the chassis just the tires and what have you all right so on to the Inferno GT3 this is from the Kyosho this is a kit and uh, it goes for a 599 but uh, as of right now yeah, I'll throw a promo code in there and that'll save you 80 bucks off that one. All right, so there's those two. So now you know on that part of it. Back over to the arm. So anyway, this thing is a, it's a good, I mean, it's a good truck other than the fact that the radios, you guys know about the radios. If you are an Arma fan or you've had some of the other Spectrum radios that you know, some of them are junk, but their higher models are better, but I can't comment on that one because I've never owned a Spectrum radio. But uh, anyway, just showing you the condition of this thing here too. And I looked like as far as on eBay, just trying to get an idea of what these things are going for. So I'm gonna get, I'm not gonna say pretty solid on 450 as of right now. You know, that's unfortunate. Yeah, that's what it is for now. Uh, Cause that's over, that's a hundred bucks basically off that price. And I know that would be a brand new one to come with the radio and all that good stuff. But anyway, that's what I'm selling it for. If by chance you don't want the electronics in it, then uh, knocking another, you know, if we're talking 450, take another, you know, 125 off that one. Because I, I'd have liked the electronics as far as this motor. Oops. The motor and the electronic speed controller are nice. The receiver, I don't care about. And the servo, it's okay. We'll go with that. Now, um, onto this one as far as these little shocks here. There is like a rip in a couple of them. They're super thin. And they, yeah, they did rip. But it's not like it's going to make or break anything because most RC cars don't even have these little shock covers on them. So I would just say that's just kind of an added bonus. So if they go, you know, whatever on that part. So let me go ahead and just kind of sweep over this thing here so you guys can take a look at it. Just kind of go slow so you can see everything on there. Now I try to keep everything oiled and everything like that, but there's always those little possibilities of like a little bit of rust here or there. Because if it gets wet, so there might be a couple screws, a couple screws that might have a little bit. Like I did notice on the servo, there's like that little spot of rust. We'll see on that part of it. Anyway, now, but yeah, it does come with what you see here. So if you're asking for anything else, it is comes with what you see here. <laughs> That's it. So it comes with the straps. It has this adjustable little thing for the uh, battery tray. And you know it's been ran and it's only been ran as far as the times that it, you've seen it on YouTube as far as the video so anytime you see this thing run is when I'm running it so I think maybe less than five times I guess something like that I don't think I've ran it more than five times and as far as jumping this thing up high or anything like that you saw that one video I, I did I jumped it a few times there and then of course one of the shock little bottom pieces on it that it pulled out and that was game over on that part of it and I replaced them so other than that, that's the only part that was broken, but you can see as far as the chassis goes here, and it's got some scratches here and there, unfortunately, being aluminum. And you can see there's a little bit of like that, a little bit of rust, but spray it down with a little bit of oil. Anyhow, but most of them I always got 
So yeah, there's a couple you know scratches up on the front here. It is a used vehicle, so that's part of the the game, right? So anyway, anyway, let me know if you guys are interested in one of these or in, interested in this one. Sorry, not in these because unfortunately I don't carry Arma. But anyway, till next time, it's Joe with OMGRC. You guys, let me know what you think. You guys, take care. Thank you for watching.